On account of reading some fellow K-Dick from the library, I now know the original story that became the Adjustment Bureau, i.e. Adjustment Team. This video is for people who have either watched the movie or read the book, both or neither, really. I'm not going to be giving any spoilers for either version here. So basically the movie is a love story where Matt Damon's character as Senator, or Senator to be, is faced with the choice of following his poli political career, political career, or following this, this woman, this woman, and we're given very distinct descriptions of what will happen in both cases, except we don't know exactly what it is his policies will be, but I think they were maybe trying to sneak some liberalism past the common viewer. And the book, the short story in the book, 20 pages, is about, it's sci-fi thriller, and it's about a man who you know, in both versions, we have this regular guy seeing behind the curtain, seeing an adjustment in progress by the ominous adjustment team or bureau. And in the short story, it's really more about that. There is no real choice as such. It's just that he sees it and it really terrifies him. The short story is far creepier, creepier than the movie. The movie isn't exactly, you know, the Adjustment Bureau in the movie is a bit unnerving, but in the short story it's almost chilling. And it's basically, you know, he sees past it and then, you know, he can't tell anyone. And we are given, there, there's no real choice other than that he has to convincingly keep anyone else from discovering it. And the result, what they're trying to do with the adjustments, is described in detail. We again don't learn about the nature of them which is great, and yeah, instead of, you know, these very definite, let's say, career-wise details, we get the other details, the details of what the end result will be, and you can then agree or disagree with Mr. Dick's hypothesis. I'm not entirely sure it's realistic, taking into consideration human nature, but it was a moment of optimism on his part. So basically, if you have watched the movie, don't read the book expecting it to be basically a loose blueprint for the film. They are quite different. The basic concept is really all that they have in common. The approach is very different. And if you've read the short story and you're considering the movie, again, it's very, very different. And, you know, if you want something close to the short story in film form, well, I hear Dark City is a lot closer to that kind of vision, and, you know, The Matrix also, to some extent. And if you haven't watched or read, it depends on what you'd prefer of 
an approach, you know, if you want this really creepy, paranoid, there's more going on behind the scenes kind of thing, or if you want a love story that spells out the whole forbidden lovers thing. Yeah. I hope this was informational. I'll see you next time.